Okay, welcome everyone. This is our uh, weekly blog meeting, and this will be a little bit different today. I have all of our residents here. It's uh, on a Sunday afternoon, and the idea of this meeting is to just sit and talk informally about what I do when someone's sitting in front of me, because I'll just write out herbs very quickly for everybody. We'll go over the typical pulses that you see clinically, and then I'll just simply tell you what I use to make that pulse normal. Okay? And then another question, um, uh, when people have this acid reflux, um, do you sometimes use the astringents and sometimes you use Wallenzu and Muli. Yeah. Do you find one works better than okay. the other? That's the next pulse that you're going to see, or the next complaint. You'll see either they have a deep pulse here, or they have this big, huge pulse. And on top of that, because you, you tell them, oh, you've got gastritis, and they'll say, yeah, I've got gastritis. And, say, and then you can feel, especially if they have the styloid pulse here, you know that the stomach's pushing on their diaphragm. And in that case, uh, they, they, they have acid reflux. And so, what do you do? You say, do you have acid reflux? I'll say, oh yeah, I have that too. Then, then what you add to the formula is muli and walenza. And you, it depends on how bad the reflux is. You can add 15 grams of muli and 15 grams of walenza. Then you have to cut the percentage down on all the other stuff. But that will usually put an end to their... That combined with the astringents and, you know, the other stuff that we talked about here... Um, usually put an end to the reflux. Reflux is very easy for us to treat. In most cases, I don't even have to focus on it. Just treating all their other complaints, how, you know, you 